Hi everybody and welcome back to my kitchen. Many years ago, I saw this little simple recipe on television. Uh, told Just told by an individual that they fixed it every summer and it was a good summer pie. Now that was before the days of Greek, the thicker Greek yogurt. He used just plain yogurt. But my store, the store that I've been frequenting, did not have just plain yogurt. All they had was the Greek. And that's fine. I'm sure it'll work. We're going to use two containers of yogurt. This one is blueberry. I'll get that all mixed up. And this one is peach. If you want to use two of the same flavor, you know, do that. I really wanted blueberry lemon, but they didn't have any lemon yogurt, so I got peach. So I'm going to mix these two yogurts together. I don't know, I, I, for some strange reason I never forgot this little recipe. I guess because it was simple and and it really did sound good for a, a hot summer day to have something like this. I've never tried a combination of blueberries and peaches but hopefully it'll all work out. Let me taste. Hmm. It's good. All right. This is a non-fat yogurt. Next thing going in is eight ounces of a whipped topping. Now this isn't non-fat, but I probably should have gotten non-fat. But this is going in. And if I remember correctly, we'll find out in just a minute. But if I remember right, he said this is made two pies. It's been so long ago, I hope I'm not leaving anything out. Because this sure looks like nothing but whipped cream to me. I was kind of hoping it'd have some whole, whole berries in here. But it didn't. This particular... Greek yogurt didn't. Let me see. Mmm. I can't taste the blueberries, but I can taste those peaches. All right, I think this is. mixed well enough. I see one little piece of fruit. You see it. Alright, here's my graham cracker pie crust. Oops, a daisy. Spread it around in there. Mm. 
I don't know if this will make two or not. I'm going to swirl that top a little bit and make it look prettier. You know, you just swirl and lift. Alright, I'm going to consider this one pie. I'm going to go ahead and fill up the other pie shell and then these are going to go in the freezer for at least four hours and we'll come back and taste them after they've frozen. This is a frozen pie, but doesn't that sound good when it's hot outside? You get this pie out of the freezer and it'll cool you right down. Hi guys, we're back. It's been about two hours and the pie is partly frozen. <laughs> But I just didn't wait till it got completely frozen for some strange reason. And it only made one pie. I started putting what was left of the filling in the other pie shell. And it just wasn't enough for a decent pie. So I just put it all in here. Let's get this out. It could probably use another hour or so. Uh, Sam is right here. <laughs> I gotta taste something. Got that... his fork ready. Yep. See if you can tell me what kind of pie that is, Sam. Well now I'm connoisseur of pies. Well, I taste peach. Yeah. Mmm. Delicious pie. Do you taste any of the blueberries? There's blueberries in there also. Mm -hmm. It's peach and blueberry. Well, that first bite I did. That first bite I didn't, but I do now. The second bite. Mmm, it's, it's very creamy and light and... Refreshing for yeah, a hot day. Mm -hmm. Do you think it probably could use another container of yogurt in there? Or? I wouldn't think so. I think I think this is fine. Okay, guys, you use whatever two flavors you want to, or use two of the same kind. Whatever you want to do to make this pie. And you know, when you're busy on a holiday like Fourth of July, or even. Um, Labor Day weekend, and you're busy with smoking that Boston butt or barbecuing that chicken and uh, whatever else you're having. You want something simple that you could do the day before and not have to worry or even think about dessert. You know, you could make a couple of these. And um, hopefully you have guests that are kind enough to add to your meal. But this is our yogurt pie, and I, like I said, I have chosen peach and blueberry, but you choose whatever you want to. Thank you for coming in today and spending a part of your day with me. Give me a thumbs up, please, and, and subscribe if you have it. It only takes a minute, not even a minute. Until next time, you take care.